it's really hard to decide which of the books in this series I should recommend, but you should read at least one of them. 100 Books You Must Read, number 99, Mr. Midshipman Hornblower, by C.S. Forrester. This book is the first in a series about Horatio Hornblower, a sailor in the English Navy during the Napoleonic Wars. He is quick-witted and brave, and lovable because he doesn't know it. The series follows his life as midshipman through promotions to lieutenant, captain, commodore, and admiral. This series has influenced other series like the Sharp novels by Bernard Cornwell and those of Patrick O'Brien. This list shows the books in chronological order of Hornblower's life, even though this is the order in which they were written. Mr. Midshipman Hornblower, Lieutenant Hornblower, and Hornblower and the Hotspur were made into a mini-series with Johan Griffith as Horatio Hornblower. The Happy Return, A Ship of the Line, and Flying Colors were made into a movie with Gregory Peck as Hornblower. I highly recommend both of them. I was never much of an adventure person before, but I really enjoy both of them. And now, just a little poetry to brighten your day. By Henry Wadsworth Longfellow. The tide rises, the tide falls. The tide rises, the tide falls. The twilight darkens, the curlew calls. Along the sea sands, damp and brown, the traveller hastens toward the town, and the tide rises, the tide falls. Darkness settles on roofs and walls, but the sea, the sea in darkness calls. The little waves with their soft white hands efface the footprints in the sands, and the tide rises, the tide falls. The morning breaks, the steeds in their stalls stamp and neigh as the hostler calls. The day returns, but nevermore returns the traveller to the shore, and the tide rises, the tide falls.